save our planet. Panamanian island dwellers prepare to leave ancestral homes. For the indigenous Kuna people, who have lived for hundreds of years on islands in an archipelago off Panama's northwestern coast, the increasingly intense effects of climate change, such as stronger winds, storms, and higher tides, are now leaving them in ankle or knee-deep water, often for days on end. Their situation has also been made worse by the harvesting and acidification of many offshore coral reefs, which previously provided protection. Sea level rises of up to 59 centimeters have been forecast by the United Nations to occur by century's end. However, those calculations did not account for what is now known to be the accelerated melting of vast ice sheets in Antarctica and Greenland, and scientists more recently warned that the seas could rise two meters instead. Thus, with the prospect of conditions only worsening, some of the island's 32,000 people have begun to prepare for a move to the Panamanian mainland. In other areas of the world, communities on island nations such as Papua New Guinea, Vanuatu, and Fiji have already had to relocate due to rising sea level effects, such as inundation of buildings and saltwater contamination of crops. Hector Guzman, a marine biologist specialist at the Smithsonian Tropical Research Institute in Panama, states, This is no longer about a scientist saying that climate change and the change in sea level will flood a people and affect them. This is happening now in the real world. We send our prayers for the strength and resiliency of the Panamanian Kuna people at this difficult time. May we all heed such warning signs from science and nature alike to act quickly in sustainable ways and avert the loss of lands, cultures, and lives. Supreme Master Ching Hai has on several occasions spoken of the devastating effects of rising sea levels and how to address this urgent matter as during an October 2009 video conference in Indonesia. The threats imposed by global warming are more than imminent. They are already here. As you can see through many disasters, upheavals, uh, climate refugees uh, phenomena around the world. It's the rise in sea levels as well that force people to lose their homes, their ancestral home, to go back in elsewhere losing also their dignity, losing everything, not just physical possession, losing their loved ones as well. We must change while there is still time. So please everyone, plant veg, <laughs> be veg, and we can go green later when we already save the planet. <laughs>